Hey there, I'm Sarah, head magic maker of the Sisters Enchanted, where it's our mission to make magic mainstream, and I am bringing you our Star Speak Astrology forecast for the week of April 28th, 2019. All right, so I'm Sarah, I'm our head magic maker, and I'm going to give you our Star Speak Astrology forecast that Nick, our headmaster of astrology, he teaches our Expedition Astrology program, has written for us. He writes it, I read it, little teamwork there. All right, let's see what he has to say. This week, we have Saturn, the planet of maturity and honesty, taking a backspin retrograde. Da, da, da. Then Mars, the planet of drive and action, clicks into a difficult position with Jupiter, the planet of perceptions and abundance. Not only that, but they both create a challenge to Neptune, the planet of dreams and indulgence. Prepare for illusions around us to disappear faster than we may be ready for. Oh no. <laughs> Nobody likes when they lose their illusions and get thrown straight into reality. I know I don't anyway. For the last year, Saturn has been traveling through its home sign of Capricorn, the sign most concerned with putting you to work. This has caused us to feel a pinch of anxiety that we are not being responsible for our own life path. Now with the turning retrograde, we must take a look at all of the work that we've done up until now. If we've been responsible and continued to work towards our achievements, then chances are there will, this will be a time period where you will notice others giving you recognition. If not, then it will be a time when the world feels like it's squashing you into a pancake. <laughs> Slow down and make a list of everything you need to work on because organization is the best way to work through tough Saturn influences. That makes so much sense for me right now. I'm definitely pancake status. We also have Mars and Gemini, the sign most concerned with conversations and collecting information. The gas giant, Jupiter, has been traveling retrograde through Sagittarius, making us take a deep look inward at the way we perceive the world and whether our current direction is true to our overall destiny. When two planets are opposite like this, they have a very difficult time working together. And these two planets are prepared to make the conversations we have create some really loud fireworks. Try not to let your anger get swept away by your conversations and really make sure to collect more information before jumping to conclusions. Pause, breathe, think before you react. There may be heavy realizations this week because these two planets burn through the fog that Neptune creates. This has been a cycle that we've been working through for a few weeks and will last at least until the end of next week. We may find that the truth hasn't been given to us, but this is ultimately a lesson that our own perceptions have been misguided. I can see some of that in my own life right now also. Sometimes people simply don't know how to tell us something that they think may hurt us. Attempt to listen to the other person's point of view because the only person who can truly be honest to us all the time is our own selves. Wowzers! Sounds like some good big stuff happening and lots of room for magic making and an improvement and moving forward. Um, a great suggestion for this week uh, we have actually uh, a new moon at the end of this week, and we also are celebrating Beltane here in the Northern Hemisphere. So maybe set some intentions for the light months ahead and look at all of this stuff that's happening and see where your intentions, where you can shine light on the truth of your desires, the truth of your soul's purpose, and the truth at hand where you're contributing to your life in a positive way and maybe not in such a positive way. So use all of this amazing seasonal energy and astrological energy to move yourself forward this week. All right, thanks for hanging with us. I'm Sarah of the Sisters Enchanted, and I'll see you for next week's Star Speak Astrology forecast. Until then, I hope you have a magical day ahead. Bye. <laughs>